Unveiling the Power of Emotions in Communication Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into an intriguing aspect of language and communication, appeal to emotions. This concept is a key player in persuasive speaking and writing, and understanding it can greatly enhance your ability to communicate effectively in English. So, let's get started and explore how appealing to emotions works and why it's so impactful. An appeal to emotions is a rhetorical strategy used to persuade an audience by eliciting emotional responses rather than using logical arguments. This technique is based on the understanding that people are often more influenced by their emotions than by facts alone. When someone uses this strategy, they aim to connect with you on a personal level, tapping into feelings such as happiness, fear, anger, or sympathy to drive their point home. To see how this works in practice, let's look at some examples. Advertisements often use emotional appeals to create a strong connection between you and a product. For instance, a commercial for a charity helping children might show happy faces of children after receiving help, aiming to stir feelings of compassion and generosity. Political speeches are another area where emotional appeals are frequently employed. Politicians might evoke feelings of pride, hope, or fear encouraging voters to support them based on emotional resonance rather than policy details alone. Recognizing when an appeal to emotions is being used is crucial for critical thinking. Here are some signs, the use of vivid and emotional language that aims to make you feel a certain way, stories or anecdotes that tug at your heartstrings, visuals that are designed to elicit a strong emotional response. While emotional appeals can be powerful, it's important to understand their impact. They can strengthen a message by making it more relatable and memorable, manipulate feelings to persuade people to act in a certain way, sometimes bypassing rational judgment, influence decisions more effectively than logical arguments in many cases. Appeal to emotions is a double-edged sword in communication. It can enrich your messages and create deep connections with your audience. However, as learners and users of English, it's vital to use this tool responsibly and to be aware of when it's being used on us. We hope this video has shed light on the power of emotional appeals in language. Remember, Understanding the emotional aspect of communication opens up a new dimension of expressing and interpreting messages. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next video.